Well, first thing is this stupid brick pile has to be moved over to here because I don't know how many bricks I have. So if I stack them like this, then I'll know how many I have. And then I can figure out how many square feet of uh, the brick I have so that I can put a patio right here in this area here. So this will all be patioed. We did it. Yeah, we got the pile moved. Yeah, I, I honestly did not think we'd get this done today. So now I guess I got to, uh, now I can measure these, find out how big the patio is going to be. And then I'll get that marked out maybe over the weekend and start working on smoothing the ground up. And the reason I'm doing the patio now is I found a new product at the, uh, at the, big box store it's called uh, paver base so it's like a plastic uh, base that you can put underneath the brick so you don't have to have all the 304 p gravel whatever you use for uh, bricks uh, because I can't get a truck back here or a wheelbarrow with the way everything's situated so anyways uh, that's it that was a big win for us today yeah and uh, now uh, we got to do the traditional uh, burger and beers yeah burger all right and beer. burger and beer. all right let's <laughs> All right, well, I'm getting ready to start on the patio project. I guess it's a continuation of the brick move portion. So I'm going to be back here in the back. This is a part of the property that just go has gone ignored since I've uh, purchased the house. And I don't think the lady before me did anything. So, I, you know, nothing happens back here. I'm going to finally make some use of it. I mean, for this neighborhood this lot's actually pretty deep so pretty lucky there um anyways so this is what i got so i did i mowed a little bit back here i had a tarp back here but i got a whole bunch of these small trees that grow up i don't know they're quick growing trees so i'm going to cut them all back and uh then I'll bring the mower back here and we're going to start to work on getting uh, the location identified for the new patio. I think the patio is going to be 12 by 12. I believe I have enough bricks to get there or I'm so close it just cost a couple bucks to get a couple extra. So I'll just uh, mow all of this down, clear it up, and then I'll probably lay it out um, where I want to be where where everything's going to be and uh, anyways I'm going to go ahead and set it up in time-lapse mode and just put it over here in the corner and record and let you watch All right, so just getting all those small, uh, fast-growing little trees out of here really cleared it up so you can see where I'm going to be putting this patio. And all this ground ivy, this stuff is like everywhere in this area. It grows real strong. Uh, so I'm going to mow it all down, but when the patio is done and probably in place uh, probably next spring, all this ivy is going to come back up and grow all the way around it. So you're going to see me with the lawnmower, but don't worry, the stuff's coming back, and that's what's going to be uh, all around the patio when I'm done. All right, so this is just the first layer of getting it all cleaned up. 
I got the mower down about, I don't know, uh, inch and three quarter. And then there are some roots that'll need to be worked on here. I got some here. And then there's this bunch over right here. I gotta cut that back. And I think there was another one over here. Yep, right there. Anyways, uh, so that's all I'm gonna do with the mower for the moment. Um, I'm not sure what my next step is here. Uh, I guess probably get the saws off and try to hit these roots that are sticking up and then maybe bring in the weed whacker to cut through some of this crap. So anyways, uh, this is the first time I ever mowed back here like this, so it's pretty neat. Uh, pl there's plenty of room. And the one thing that I want to do back here is a, uh, why the patio is coming back here is because during the summer, my deck is in a full sun area and it's just super hot in the during the day and it's just not fun to sit out there uh and you know it's just hard to relax uh over here obviously it's full shade so this is uh why i'm gonna put the put the patio out here with a couple of chairs for uh middle of the day in the summer <laughs> 